everyone, Megan O'Leavy here in Dallas, Texas, and I'm with Roy Nelson, one of the stars of UFC 185, and we're going to chat today, but also we're going to play some Jenga, because why not, right? And it's another game that I can win. I'll let you have the first move, since you're very confident. Are we supposed to go for the base right away? I, I, I like to, you know, challenge Live myself. Live on the edge. <laughs> All right, fair enough. So now you're here in Texas for your fight against oh, Alex Harrell. Oh, you Talk to me about that. We're in Dallas, you know, and, and the one thing they like in Texas is everything big, so. And we're big guys, so <laughs> yeah. I, it, it's one thing I think is going to definitely be fun. There we go. There we go. Okay. Every win you have in the UFC is a knockout or two KO. That's what fans like. So that's what I try to give them. We're heavyweights, so we're always trying to go the easiest round. How are you expecting the fight with Alistair Overeem to go? I like fights that you have to, you have to watch for every second because then it makes it very exciting. Is Alistair a guy that you've wanted to fight for a long time? Yeah, ever since uh, when he fought Brock, he was coming off being a strike force champ, K1, Dream, right. the whole nine yards, and uh, anytime you're, you know, trying to move ahead in the the pecking order, you always want to fight the, you know, the best guy in the world. You just want to make it exciting. Do you feel like every day you're training, you're still continuing to learn new skills and perfect the skills that you have? Yeah, the, the one thing about, you know, being in this business, you're always learning. Just always trying to make yourself better every, you know, every time. Let's talk about your UFC extracurriculars. Besides being one of the best fighters in the world, you also are now in movies. Tell me how this came about. So it's kind of like a full circle. This is kind of actually the reason why I actually got into doing martial arts, is I wanted to be a B-movie star like Billy Blinks. It actually just lucked out, and there was a Scorpion King 4, which I thought was, you know, going to be, you know, it was really fun. I got I to gotta be my own stuntman. I got to do sword fights. It was actually really, really, really cool. Um, and it was exciting, so I thought, hey, why not? I could do this. Why did I pick this one? What was I thinking? Dang it! I really thought I had it. I thought this is where I beat Roy Nelson at something. Before I let you go, you just kicked my butt at Jenga, I want to know your prediction for your fight on Saturday night against Alistair Overeem at UFC 185. Um, with every fight, my hand raised, but as heavyweights, we always promise fireworks. I'm looking forward to it. Roy Nelson always puts on a show. Can't wait to see you back in that octagon. Best of luck to you. Thanks. Thanks, and congrats on winning. Not better. <laughs>